Hey everyone, welcome to Ecocalypse. So we're here to do advanced team building and let's group the uh, cases first according to a category that I made so that we could uh, lump them and probably identify who belongs in that group in order for us to create a team. A team we're in it's more on based on uh, not on the individual cases but on the positions that they are occupying okay so first um, position would be your dps so we have obvious dps's like for example uh, you have fenrir here you have Iken here they're very obvious as dps but one classification as well that you might see is for mc is offense and defense so Technically, um, uh, MC is going to be classified as DPS. So when you see those um, types, they will be classified under DPS. Okay. The next category or position would be defense. So for defense, you, I, we only have a few. I'm going to point out two. Your first would be Yulia. So Yulia obviously is damage absorption. She's going to be in the defense category. Then the other one would be Set. So Set is also damage absorption. Although her kit is kind of more on offense oriented, but still we I, I still have to put her under defense. Okay, so damage absorption will be your defense category. Next up is going to be your support. Supports are actually very obvious because they're also labeled as supports. So as you can see here, Lina is a support. We also have Bastet as a support. And the other example is going to be Neftis. Okay, these supports usually have a mix of either giving out a shield or healing. So those are our classifications of your supports. And the last um, category or um, category or group would be your debuffer slash control. They are they're going to be more tricky because there are a lot of debuffers and control out there. The examples would be Niz. So because it's yeah, she's going to be AOE control. She has um, she has freeze. So freeze actually skips a turn for the enemy. So debuffer and control. The other example would be Garula. Garula is AOE heal reduction. So again, that's a debuff. The next one I think would be Baphomet. This is just an example. Okay, there are a lot of uh, cases that have similar. Um, titles or uses so aoe debuff is also a debuffer and control so rayon is actually also debuffer and control she has burn so for those who have uh, burn capabilities they're gonna be under debuffer and control um there's a special team exclusively for burn i'm not gonna include them here they're they're called a themed team with all burn so burn Burn units may be mixed with um, these formations. That is what we're going to discuss. The theme lineups, I'm not going to discuss here. Vivi is also the debuffer and control. And the and also this girl, Wadjet, is also a debuffer. Is a counter to high attack. She's a debuffer slash control. So now we have... Um, we have uh, identified the four groups. So again, I'm just going to repeat. DPS, defense, support, and debuffer control. Okay, so the first one is called a balance team. It's a balance because you have one defense, one one support, and one debuffer control. So one one of each, then the rest would be your DPS. So very balanced. I've tried this lineup out. This works perfectly for me. I like a balance setup because I can use them anywhere. Okay, so our second lineup is going to be more on the damage side. So as you can see here, I have one, two, three, four DPS, one defense, and one support. So heavy on the damage, this team would 
you know so the, the the trick or the objective that this team is to do much as much early damage as possible okay another team here which is more on the damage side would be you have one support one control debuffer and four dps so as you can see here one two three four dps and you have your debuffer and you have your support so again you have a choice of the previous one and this one for more damage so it's up to you if you're gonna be focusing on more damage but also have defense more damage and also have debuff and control so off to our fourth lineup okay guys so for our fourth lineup this is going to be more of a turn control or scenario control team so you have um three dps on front two um debuffer and control at the back they will be responsible for the shenanigans for your team and obviously you have a support again to go with this team this team is going to be slow on the damage but definitely they will be controlling the tempo or the turn of the other team so after this is our last lineup okay guys so for our last lineup this is our defensive lineup so the defense here would be coming from the shenanigans for the two uh, debuffers and uh, control which is niz and garula again you can swap with any who have the same i've explained actually um the groupings of these cases so you have there your debuffer control at the back you have yulia in the front that is your defense you only have two offensive um cases here which is mc and Iken. and again i would highly encourage that you still have a support a healer or a support who has both healing and and um and shields so that is it so you have five lineups that we've discussed you have balanced two more on the damage side one on turn control and this one for defense so that is it guys hopefully this video has helped and um, comments down below on which lineup do you like and which lineup do you prefer so thank you very much take care stay safe this is the warden and i'm out of here